Well, as you all may know, I've got a bit of horse trader in me. That's how I do things. I'm going to show you something here. These are all selling, trading, whatever. All postal receipts with tracking numbers. And just the last, look at this. This is just the last year or two, I guess you could say. I don't know, I can't even, let's see. If I go all the way to the back one, it's so faded I can't even read it, so I'm not worrying about it, but I'm just making a point. This is what I do. I do a lot of horse trading, buying and selling. I don't know why, it's just in my nature. I'm going to show you something else. I haven't cleaned these up, up yet. But, here is the original, original, meaning before they shitted them up. These are the Ugly Stick Tiger Jigging Rods. I need to clean them up. They've been sitting around. I haven't used them in quite a while. But as you can see right there, Shakespeare Ugly Stick Tiger Light Jigging. And what makes these different is number one, that's a Fuji gunmetal gray reel seat. It's not no proprietary, you know, uh, Shakespeare wannabe. It's got the aluminum gimbals on them. It's got the Jetty Wolf's proprietary hook holder that everybody finds so amazing. These rods are original because of really this. No ugly, tough, nasty ass guides. These here are Fuji regular guides that we're all used to. And I've got, I don't know, what, four or six of these rods. And every single one is in the exact same condition. There's nothing wrong with them. Alright, so... That's what I'm horse trading now. I haven't used these. I'm going to clean them for you. I'm going to clean them up very nicely. Because they are dirty. They were used and then just put away. They've got the jigging reel seat. And these can be used for about everything. Sharks. Bull reds. Jigging, of course. Vertical jigging, yes. They're, they're six foot three. Six foot three. Four to seven ounce. But let me tell you, these can take a r really big fish. You could troll for Wahoo with these. There's where it says Fuji right there. It says Fuji right there too, but it's upside down. But I'm gonna clean these up, I think, today. I believe I've got four or six of them. I know I have four. Because I don't have anything less than sets of four. And if you're interested, email me at jettywolf at gmail.com. J E T T Y W O L F at gmail.com and everything will be in the video description below. They've got these contoured foregrips right there. Super duper light. These ain't grandpa's old ugly stick. 
These, this tiger rod here is so light you can fish it all day long. And I'm kind of starting out. I'm going to start out here at about 55 bucks because you're not going to find these. You're not going to find these anywhere close to as nice as these are. The more you buy, the cheaper they get. You take them all off my hands, you're going to get a, you'll get a, um, a Pickers bundle deal. I need to get rid of some rods, and I have not used these in a couple years. So, do not confuse these with the newer ones. Do not confuse these. The newer ones are breaking. And they're breaking about six inches from the tip. I've had I've had two or three break in the exact same spot all in one week of the new ones. So that's what I do. If you don't like it, lump it. I horse trade. And I'm going to be passing these on to their next home. You could use these for everything, man. I'm telling you, you could you could each you could put the, a decent reel on these, and you're trolling one minute, you're bottom fishing the next, you're 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 vertical jigging, or you're running and gunning behind a shrimp boat catching a hundred pound black tip. It all depends on what you do, but they're going to be local pickup, Jacksonville, Florida. On the way to Mayport, I'm five minutes from the Mayport boat ramp. JettyWolf at gmail.com if you're interested. Just shoot me an email. Talk to you later. By the way, I just counted. I got six of them. I'm sorry. And another thing is local pickup only. I'm not shipping these. People always seem to want me to ship stuff to them. And I mean, you know what a pain in the ass this is to ship rods? I used to have hundreds, probably, of rod tubes. And when I did an addition, or a non-addition, when I did a renovation to my house and I got a free dumpster. Because why? I did horse trading. I took a guy fishing and he gave me a dumpster for like two weeks for free. A big old 30 yarder. I mean, it was a big one. Probably would have cost me four or five hundred dollars. We horse traded, went out, caught some big ass trout on a freezing cold February day. Had ourselves a blast. So, no, I'm not shipping these. These are local pickup, Jacksonville, Florida. So if you're in the area and you need, these are such do-all rods, it's in, unbelievable. No, they're not for no creaking. They're for big water, big fish. Come on!